Today, we are going to install the new DRT Motorsports CAX3 RS2 two door tree kickers. These kickers fit the 2017 Plus Can Am X3 two door models. Install time is over an hour. Can be installed by yourself with a difficulty level of intermediate. Tools needed for this job are a 3 8 ratchet, a 16 and 18 mm socket, a 16 and 18 mm ratchet and wrench, a 6 to 8 mm drill bit and hand drill, a tape measure and straight edge, cutting tools for plastic, and don't forget your safety glasses. So, gather the tools and let's install. Before you start this install, go over all the information in this video and reference it against your vehicle to make sure measurements and placements will be accurate. Double check everything before you cut any holes into your plastics. If you have any questions, please contact DRT customer support. First, three holes have to be cut into the lower plastics on both sides of the vehicle so the rock rail can be bolted directly to the framework. The holes are here, here, and here. Each hole needs to be cut 2 to 2.25 inches in diameter. Each hole is placed directly in front of a factory mounting hole that goes through the framework so no drilling has to be done to the frame. We will begin measuring and laying out the center of the front and middle holes from this point on the plastic. The center of the front hole needs to be 14.75 inches forward and 1.5 inches up from the bottom of the plastic. The center of the middle hole needs to be 3.5 inches back and 1.5 inches up from the bottom of the plastic. The center of the back hole measures differently. We will start measuring from this point on the plastic, just at the point the radius of the plastic flattens out. For this center, we will follow the top of the plastic line straight back 28.75 inches. The best way to do this, is with a long straight edge, on top of the plastic as shown here. Now, the last thing to know is, access to the back side of the frame for the front hole mount, is from under the car, shown here. Access to the back side of the frame for the middle hole mount, is from inside the vehicle shown here. Access to the back side of the frame for the rear hole mount, is from inside the vehicle, but you have to cut, or drill a hole in the plastic around here. The best way to know where the hole needs to be is, after cutting the 2.25 inch outside hole, take a long drill bit, and by using the frame hole as a guide, drill from outside through the inside plastic. Now that the holes are all cut, you are headed to the rear sway bar mount. This is where the fourth tree kicker mount is installed. Now, you are going to remove the backing nuts off of the sway bar mount, with an 18mm socket and ratcheting wrench. Then, set the backing nuts aside, as we will remount them shortly. Next, pull the two 18mm bolts halfway out to prepare for the tree kicker placement. Now, pick up your tree kicker, line it up with the holes, and put it in place. The kicker should hold itself up in place while you line up the sway bar mounting position. Next, with the kicker mount lined up, push the bolts back through the sway bar mount, and thread the backing nuts on by hand, finger tight. Do not tighten these bolts at this time.
Now, grab the three 16mm bolts and start the installation at the front mounting location, gaining access to the framework through the factory access hole under the vehicle. Then, install the bolt through the back of the framework, align the kicker and begin threading the bolt by hand. Next, do the same to the middle and rear bolts, but access them through the interior of the vehicle as shown earlier. Then, grab your ratchet and 16mm socket, or your 16mm ratcheting box wrench, whichever works best, as space is limited, and tighten down all three mounting locations. Next, move to the sway bar mount and tighten down the two 18mm bolts. Now, just repeat these steps on the other side of the vehicle and you are ready to go. Congrats, that completes your DRT, X3, two-door tree kicker install. Now, that really changes the look of your Can-Am. With some much added side protection, you have further coverage from the elements around you, and it's just what's needed if you're into extreme trail riding, or rock crawling your X3. Until we meet on your next DRT install, be safe out there. If you have any questions during your installation, don't hesitate to contact us via phone or email. We are here to help.